Beginning English class, lesson 103. Welcome to my Beginning English as a Second Language class. This is lesson 103 in an ongoing ESL class that I teach at Mount Hood Community College in Gresham, Oregon. Thank you for watching. I feel sick. What's the question? How do you feel? They felt sick. What's the question? How did they feel? He is feeling sick. How is he feeling? She is going to feel sick. How is she going to feel? I was feeling sick. How were you feeling? How is he going to be? What's the answer? He is going to be sick. How long have you been feeling sick? I have been feeling sick for a week. How are they going to be feeling tomorrow? They are going to be feeling sick. What's the tense? Present tense. What's the question? Who feels sick? What's the tense? Past tense. What's the question? Who felt sick? What's the tense? Present continuous tense. What's the question? Who is feeling sick? What's the tense? Future tense. What's the question? Who is going to feel sick? What's the tense? Past continuous tense. What's the question? Who was feeling sick? What's the tense? Future tense. What's the question? Who's gonna be sick? What's the tense? Present, perfect, continuous. What's the question? Who has been feeling sick for a week? What's the tense? Present, perfect, continuous. What's the question? Who's going to be feeling sick? The verb to be, the past participle, been. 
the verb to feel, the past participle felt. Present continuous, she is feeling sick at home. One hour ago, past continuous, she was feeling sick at home one hour ago. Present perfect continuous tense, have or has, plus been, plus the ing form of the verb. She has been feeling sick at home for one hour. What's the question? Who was feeling sick at home one hour ago? Where was she feeling sick one hour ago? When was she feeling sick at home? Who is feeling sick at home? Where is she feeling sick? How is she feeling? Who has been feeling sick at home for one hour? How has she been feeling at home for one hour? Where has she been feeling sick for one hour? How long has she been feeling sick at home? Present perfect tense. Have or has plus the past participle. She has felt sick at home for the past week. The past participle, felt. What's the question? Who has felt sick at home for the past week? How has she felt at home for the past week? Where has she felt sick for the past week? How long has she felt sick at home? She has called the doctor every day for the past week. The past participle, called. Who has called the doctor every day for the past week? Who has she called every day for the past week? When has she called the doctor? She has watched TV every day for the past week. The past participle, watched. Who has watched TV every day for the past week? What has she watched every day for the past week? When has she watched TV? What have they done this past week? Past participle, done. I have football at the park. Question, done, past participle. What's the answer, past participle? I have played football 
at the park. The past participle played. The teacher has English at school. What's the past participle? The teacher has taught English at school. We have to music at home. What's the past participle? We have listened to music at home. He has English at work. What's the past participle? He has spoken English at work. What's the question? What have you done at the park? What have you played at the park? Where have you played football? Who has played football at the park? Who has taught English at school? What has the teacher taught at school? What has the teacher done at school? Where has the teacher taught English? Who has listened to music at home? What have we listened to at home? Where have we listened to music? What has he spoken at work? Who has spoken English at work? Where has he spoken English? What have we done at home? What has he done at work? Present Perfect talks about your experiences. Presente conversaciones perfectas sobre tus experiencias. Настоящие разговоры о вашем опыте. Trình bày những cuộc nói chuyện hoàn hảo về kinh nghiệm của bạn. Chứng xin quay ý nghĩ về kinh nghiệm của bạn. Chứng xin quay I have been to New York City. He has eaten sushi. Who has been to New York City? I have. Where have you been? New York City. Who has eaten sushi? He has. What has he eaten? Sushi. Present perfect also talks about Changes in the past. Presente perfecto también habla de cambios en el pasado. Настоящий совершенный также говорит об изменениях в прошлом.
Hiện tại hoàn hảo cũng nói về những thay đổi trong quá khứ. Verb, grow. Past tense, grew. Past participle, grown. My son has grown three inches in the last year. Verb get. Past, got. Past participle, gotten. Her English has gotten better in my class this past year. Both of these sentences show how things have changed in the last year. This is the end of Beginning English Class Lesson 103. Thank you for watching.